Hey yo boys and welcome back to the Byron Post. I got a little bit of some sniffles, so if you hear some of that, don't worry, it's just because of the winter cold season. But we're here, we're on the grind, harder than a skating stripper. But uh, speaking of some slight sexual innuendos, 69, pretty cool number. <laughs> nice, uh, that's actually the number that Robert Lewandowski ended off the calendar year on, well, the entire calendar year, you know, uh, but, also, within the Bundesliga alone, uh, he scores the 43rd Bundesliga goal in 2021, breaking Gerd Müller's record for the most goals scored in a calendar year within the Bundesliga. But in total, the entire calendar year, like with all competitions and with like Poland and Bayern and everything, he has 69 goals, which is pretty nice. He equals Cristiano Ronaldo on that front. But this is the most important one. He does break Gerd Müller's record of the most goals scored in a single in a single Bundesliga calendar year. So anyways, yeah, it, it was a great game and I'm really happy about, you know, what happened. Musiala assisted him as well for his goal. It was very nice. And what a goal it was. Yo, it had me like, it almost made me jump out of my seat, you know? If I was a rabbit, I would have hopped. It would have been crazy. But, um, <laughs> yeah, for the third time in a row, Robert Lewandowski ends the year with the most goals in Europe. 2019, 2020, 2021. So now... Instead of us just saying for the past two seasons, boy, listen, all right, this season is not over yet, but it's about to be for the past three seasons. Robert Lewandowski has been the best player in the world, bar none. And I I'm serious, bro. Like, okay, I guess you can have certain debates about certain topics, certain players, but no, 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 no. Robert Lewandowski is the best player in the world. But it was a good overall team performance. I'm really happy with the way it panned out. We got that 4-0 win, and, you know, you can't ask for much more. It was at home. I mean, I could have asked for more goals, of course. If Robert Lewandowski would have scored another one, then he would have surpassed Cristiano Ronaldo in uh, overall calendar years. I mean, overall goal scored in the calendar year. But still, 69 is a nice number, as we all know. And plus, it's all right. You know, the overall record is pretty far away still. Hopefully, you can get much closer to the overall record of 91 next year. Who knows? But Robert Lewandowski, knowing him, it might be possible. But yeah, the staff is very happy with Mark Roca. I'm very happy with Mark Roca. He was rock solid yet again today. It was awesome to see him, man. It's really good. He gels well with the team. He makes great passes, great interceptions. When he wins the ball back, he sends us on the counter or he makes very accurate passes, his long passes, his short passes. You know, he nutmegged the uh, referee. It's uh, it's pretty great, man. It's awesome to see. And not only that, he's such a team player and very focused on the overall team performance and result overall. I said overall twice, but whatever, you know, uh, he went, he celebrates every goal with every player. Look at this. You know, he's always like over here. He's giving certain directions as well. Just like not as much as Mueller does, because we all know that Mueller is like the orchestra leader, but he gives some good directions within the midfield and he links the de defense in the midfield, which is really great to see. Overall, I'm really happy with Roca's performance. But, you know, I'm happy with the entire team's performance. It's really awesome to see Leroy Sonny got his goal. Obamecano got a goal. Thomas Mueller got his goal. It's really great. And, yeah, man, I just wanted to give some quick thought thoughts on this. Um, Malik Tillman also got another chance. Bonasar being played as a winger. It's, you know, some good experiments here and there. Uh, Neon Su made an amazing, amazing block. And, yeah. You know, we kept the clean sheet as well. You can't do much better than that. But it's a great way to end off our, you know, half of our season here in the winter break. Because let's be honest, you know, sometimes Bayern performs weekly. Like, we're like sitting second at this stage in a few recent years. And then we really turn it on this in the second half. But it's really great to see we end up top and in a very convincing way as well. So we're in a very good position to then springboard on and just absolutely sweep the league in the second half. And yes, a lot of people might say, okay, it's a one team league. Listen, don't listen to them. They're jealous because they can't win as good as Byron does. But yeah, man, I'm really happy with the team performance today. 
it's really great like i said uh, i jumbled on my words a lot uh you could hear me sniffling here and there uh don't worry though i ain't got corona i ain't gonna catch that just like kun castiles cannot catch a ball to save his life unless of course it's from lewandowski somehow but anyways yeah um also just wanted to point out real quick from my own personal opinion and bias the ref is a cunt for what he did at the end uh not even trying to entertain the possibility and i believe the fact that it should have been a penalty awarded to robert lewandowski uh and the var officials as well they they can go blow you know what i mean uh anyways though i just needed to get that in there real quick thank you guys for tuning in this is a short little review i'll have my overall player ratings live sometime tomorrow or later today so look forward to that and i'll go more in depth with the entire performance but yeah overall i'm really happy with it and you know now the players get a much needed rest we come back in january and when that resumes we all know that Bayern is going to get back into the dominance phase. But yeah, boys, uh, be on the lookout. So um, a lot of transfer rumors because the transfer window is going to be open. So I'm going to be making certain videos on that and just other topics covering like Bayern and stuff like that. Any any type of like big news or, or things that could resurface, you know. So yeah, be on the lookout for that. Besides that, guys, thank you guys for tuning in. If you liked the video, awesome. You know, uh, have a great day, night, or evening, whatever it may be. Stay safe, and mia samia.